very large reason why golfers do not get better in the game is a lack of attention to the mental and the emotional part of the game. We know through science and research with the very top athletes and golfers the separator between average and outstanding really lies in the mental and the emotional capabilities. What New Edge Performance and the ESI bring to the golfer is the fundamentals of the mental and the emotional part of the game. You know, everyone says that golf is primarily mental, but how much time do golfers spend on the mental and the emotional part of the game relative to the other parts? If everyone believes it's such a large part of the game, ask yourself, how much time do you spend to strengthen this part of your game? I really think a big issue is that for, for golfers and coaches too, there, there have really been no powerful, simple, mainstream tools to evaluate a golfer's mental and emotional fundamentals. And then more importantly, provide solutions and action on how to develop the capabilities. A simple science and research based tool that measures a golfer's abilities in the critical mental and emotional fundamentals. It's a very simple online tool that takes about 25 minutes to complete and it has three great pieces. Step one, a great results summary of the golfer's results in the 10 key performance fundamentals that all great players have. Step two, a nice coaching report with solutions and ideas on how to improve the fundamentals. And then step three, an action plan that the golfer and coach can work on to build a long-term development plan for sustainability. And here's a huge bonus using ESI that I love. Work on improving these fundamentals can be applied to everything the golfer does. So not only will the golfer become a better performer in the game, but in their personal and professional life, which is key. We've had so many parents connect with us and tell us how thrilled they are that their sons and daughters are learning key fundamentals through the game of golf. We know cost is important to everyone, but if you were to take the time and effort to line up consultations with sports performance specialists and psychologists, it would cost hundreds, even thousands of dollars, and who knows how much of your time. Now you can get all this powerful knowledge, backed by years of research and testing, in just minutes, online, for less than the cost of one golf lesson. You get the ESI report with the ESI results summary culture report with solutions and ideas and your own success action plan, your very own personalized roadmap to golf excellence, and then there's all the side benefits. You're able to measure yourself and get some of the world's top golfers and see where you stack up. And the increased confidence both in golf and in your daily life is great, great value. You know, feedback and satisfaction ratings from coaches and players alike has been outstanding. Hello, my name's Steve Ban. I'm coach to Stuart Appleby, KJ Choi, and 2003 amateur champion Nick Flanagan. My experience with the ESI to date has been very positive. The 18-page report with the 10 key emotional competency scores has been a very accurate assessment tool. Most importantly, it opens dialogue in a sometimes awkward area between the coach and the player. It challenges the player to work on their signature strengths and to improve the areas of their emotional competencies that clearly need improving. Both Stuart Appleby and Nick Flanagan did the test and we had almost immediate tournament success. Both the guys found there was a couple of areas they were able to go out with the simple strategies that the report produces, think about that on a daily basis and make improvements and their scoring improved almost immediately. I've really found the ESI tool very helpful in the development of both uh, the mental side and emotional side of my game. I like how it shows both strengths and weaknesses. It doesn't just focus on somebody's uh, weaknesses, whereas I think a lot of coaches do. So obviously, you know, it points out what you're good at, but yet gives you a lot of things that you can work on, with the, a lot of dot points and things that you can focus on. The results were not only beneficial to each member of the team, but they helped us become better coaches by giving us an in-depth look into what our players needed to improve upon beyond just the physical part of the game. Doesn't it make sense to you that if golf is 70% mental and emotional and your game really hasn't improved as much as you wanted it to with all the new toys and the, the tools available, that you might consider a simple mental and emotional tool like the ESI that can help you become a better player and even help you become more effective in your day-to-day -day activities with all this added value. If 
the golfer doesn't address this critical part of the game, our experience with golfers and athletes has been that in the long term, improvement and consistency will be negligible. Uh, really as it is when you watch the improvement as, uh, of most golfers. I play golf, I've been there. Hesitation, confusion, anxiety, frustration. It's not a lot of fun when you're playing. So help yourself by using the ESI. Identify your strengths and limitations and then create a plan to work on them and get better. The golfer and the coach could really do something here to enhance the golfer's mental and emotional game. Clicking on Take the ESI button, the golfer is literally 25 minutes away from some great information and solutions for their sport performance and their life.